Hey there, AI enthusiasts! Welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest news on artificial intelligence. Today, we're diving into the intriguing world of OpenAI's board of directors. Buckle up, because we've got quite the timeline to share with you. So, OpenAI, the renowned AI research lab and organization, has been making some waves lately with changes to their board. It all started when Sam Altman and Greg Brockman were let go from their positions. But why? Well, that's where the speculation begins. In a recent Hacker News post, the composition of OpenAI's board was discussed, raising concerns about conflicts of interest and the independence of their votes. You see, when it comes to a charity organization like OpenAI, conflicts of interest can be a big deal. Some commenters even questioned the role of ideology in the board's decision-making process. Now, let's talk about those recent firings. The comments section was buzzing with speculation on the motivations behind these changes. What could have led to Altman and Brockman's departure? Well, that's still up for debate. But one thing's for sure, it has sparked quite the discussion. Speaking of discussions, let's dive into the comments section. Here, we find a lively debate on the qualifications of board members. Some commenters questioned the reputation and expertise of Helen Toner, one of the board members. It seems like her qualifications are a topic of contention among the AI community. But wait, there's more. The comments section also delves into the idea of conflicts of interest in a charity organization. After all, OpenAI's mission is to ensure that artificial general intelligence benefits all of humanity. So, should there be any conflicts of interest in such an organization? It's a question that's got people talking. Now, we want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on OpenAI's board changes? Do you think conflicts of interest could impact their decision-making? And what about the qualifications of board members? Share your opinions in the comments below. That's all for today's video, folks. If you enjoyed this deep dive into OpenAI's board of directors, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more AI news. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.